Soon, two El Pasoans are using art and culture to make a difference. They've launched a brand new web platform designed to highlight creativity and resiliency of the people of the Southwest. It's called Work Project by Sunhouse Arts. We want to welcome the founders of this project, Celine and Ali Dip. Thank you both so much for being here. Well, thank you so much for having us. It's truly a delight. Tell us a little bit about this project and what inspired it all. Well, um, I suppose um, you know the work project uh, is one of our I don't know I guess sixth main um, project. Although we've produced nine films and five plays and um, educational outreaches, but essentially what we wanted to do is recognize our regional worth um, through our work. Because um, if we do not recognize our worth, we can never really understand our true value. So we're working very hard throughout um, you know this summer and also these pres uh, presiding months to definitively articulate what we already know to be true. Um, what about you, Celine? Yeah, and also just to let the Southwest represent itself. There's so many, you know, unique, important stories that make up this region. We really wanted to bring light to all of those different people that truly, you know, represent Southwestern excellence. What is some of the importance of highlighting our very unique region here, especially in El Paso? Well, I've often said that this is a metaphor for many things, this border. I mean, I would say that we are on the cusp of both ends and beginnings and futures forever. So I would say that to articulate what the borderland means to other people is that which um, truly transcends the geographical context of our border region. I mean, I just think that almost everybody that understands the provocative power and the beauty of what resilience entails would be, um, you know, tremendously benefited from understanding tales and actions done here in this region and specifically in our border plex. Um, what about you, Celine? What lessons can somebody learn from the border? Well, I just think that this is such a resilient region and, you know, our normalcy is something that just is not experienced all across the country. There's something so unique to the Southwest to living along the border. And I think there's so many lessons of just existing between two worlds, but being both and also being uniquely a borderlander that people should really, I think, learn about this region. What a great way to honor the many people of this region. Where can someone find more information if they want to follow up and explore this project further? So we have many outlets, um, uh, and actually, Celine, why don't you begin with telling them about social media and whatnot? Yeah, so we have a Facebook page, which is El Paso dot Sunhouse Arts. Um, yes, EP um, dot Sunhouse Arts, um, and then we have an Instagram, which is just Sunhouse Arts. And then we have the website, which is ourworkproject.org, ourworkproject.org. And um, we also have our own website for Sunhouse Arts at sunhousearts.org. Um, awesome. And Thank you both. This yeah. is so wonderful. And it's so great to be able to share this with the people of this region who this art is directly honoring. Thank you both so much for joining us. Oh, thank, thank you, you so much. Us, yeah. I, truly a pleasure. Stay with us. We'll be right back.